Hey everybody, I just want to read a quote for you real quick. Well, not real quick, but the quote goes, We live in an absurdly horrid age. We run where we ought to walk and we walk where we ought to sit. And we blow our motor horns if we're held up for a minute. All for the purpose of getting nowhere as quickly as possible. As a result, we spend half of our time undoing the decisions that we would not have made at all had we taken the time to think them over. And that's a quote by M.S. Burt in 1924. So, what struck me the most about that quote was the date. Because I'm thinking of how much life has sped up since 1924. So that quote was definitely ahead of its time. And its relevance will only get greater and greater as we continue this race called life. But it is imperative that we take take it slow sometimes, consciously and purposefully, so we can rest, observe, take in from our surroundings in a more intentional way, you know? You might notice something that was right in front of you all along, gain a new perspective, appreciate something new, or even the same thing but in a new way. And if you don't gain any of these things, I know this might not be on your priority list, but you might gain some rest. Now, in this video, I want you to look at water on a closer and slower level. All the things that make going to the river fun and relaxing. Having water rush over you, taking a dive, skipping stones, just watching it flow, slowing it down, looking at all the millions of bubbles and air pockets around my body as I dive, looking at the craters and columns of water splashing up from a stone skipping across the surface, the droplets as the water separates. It's also satisfying and, and mesmerizing to me, looking at the ripples and waves above and the current and shadows below. I really, really enjoyed filming this video and I hope you do too. And most importantly, I hope you get a chance to just take it slow. So thanks for watching.